Hey everyone, welcome back to the B-Movie Bunker. I know it's been a while, but I'm here once again to watch movies so you may or may not have to. We're going to start off with Shadow in the Cloud. This one is brought to us by writers Max Landis and Roseanne Liang. hope I'm pronouncing that right, or somewhere within a thousand yards of how the name should be pronounced. Uh, she is also the director. This one stars Chloe Grace Moretz and some other people who I don't really know that well, and I'm not mentioning them at this time. Um, this is a supernatural movie set during World War II and takes place pretty much entirely on or near a B-17 bomber. Um, this movie, it's, I, I wanted to like it more than I did. I'm not going to say it's a bad movie. It has moments that I think are really well done. However, I think it stumbles in some areas such as the dialogue where I think that they're trying to go for some banter between the crew and at times I think it feels a little forced. Um... I will also say that it does stretch my suspension of disbelief a little too far at times as far as what is possible. Uh, while I'm just going to say what is possible. I don't want to spoil the movie for those of you who actually do want to see that. And, and if you do like supernaturally type war movies, maybe you'll enjoy this. Um, it's not a super long movie, so it's not a huge investment of time. On a scale of 1 to 10, this is... it's. It's a Brewster Buffalo. And if you don't know what that means, the Brewster Buffalo was a fighter from World War II. And it is not the worst fighter that was made during World War II, but it's really nowhere near the best. I mean, sometimes it did its job, sometimes it failed pretty badly at doing its job. But that's how I feel about this movie, is that sometimes it, it does good things really well, and when it fails, it fails pretty badly. Um, but I still think that the director did an okay job. I would like to see what else she can do. She has some other movies she's done, and I want to check out her other stuff. Chloe, for the most part, is good. The rest of the crew, I think, uh, does what they can with the script, which, as I said, is kind of a, a mixed bag of how good it is. So that's what I got for you this week. Until next time, stay safe out there in the wasteland, folks.